this. Okay. This sun carriers, both of these were installed in December 2009. As a social commitment towards green energy mm. by Omega Ring Garings. At that time, it was not thought that there will be a building like this or something like this. But in November 2009, you must have heard that the Prime Minister was there for a green summit and he has declared that there will be a Jawala Meru in which our solar we will have around 20,000 megawatt to be produced by 2020. So then all these. Uh, schemes have come up and when it was inaugurated, the chairman of the Veldemash Energy, he had been here and after some time he had and he talked to our MP and he said that when you are doing this of this, why don't we have a partnership and have a company so that you can do the same construction of these sun carriers in India. So last year, about one year back, this company had come into existence and then this office was built up. While building this office, it was thought that why don't we have a green building? So then all the other things were thought and batteries were purchased. These batteries, as you know that in any green building, you can't have lead acid batteries because they are harmful to the environment. So these are special batteries. These are vanadium drops batteries, flow batteries first time introduced two years back in Germany and all the details will be given when we go there but, but uh, and about the installation of these uh, the company main company Omega Ring bearings is the manufacturer of white metal bearings used for industrial purposes they are manufacturing 85 percent for export as rank original bearings and for these uh, our MD used to go throughout the Europe and he has seen a lot of solar farms like these and then they were asking what is, your, what is the contribution of green energy in India and then ultimately what is the contribution of US. So he had this piece of land so he thought why, why should we have a small one. So these two uh, sun carriers, they are called as sun carriers because they are tracking the sun full day right from the morning sunrise to evening sunset they track the sun so that to get 100% out from the solar energy they are the largest in the world and the only in India at the moment only we have got these two and then another our project in Bulgaria where we have got three more such sun carriers and now we are having a solar farm of around 5 megawatts in the area So, in India, there are a lot of solar farms, but 99% are field fund. So, there are a lot of difference between solar fixed and solar tracking system. In India, they have developed a lot of tracking systems but no tracking system is as big as this one. They are all small ones, either they are sensor based or some other tracking system also. This is a single axis tracking system. There are now some small ones which are having double axis also. In this system, you can have only single axis. No double axis has been found for such a big installation. We are just waiting for our MD he wanted to because he is also from a minute. He wanted to discuss this. He wanted to 